Now let's move over to the goals. Now Salisbury softball has had no troubles with the competition in regionals. Yeah, that's right. They sure have a big 10 to 2 win yesterday in the goals with more domination this morning. The number one team in the nation already up the one with the bag pitch. full. Windsor and we have liftoff. Lindsay Windsor grand slam over the left field wall. Salisbury on top 5 nothing. And that was all Savannah Sheets needed. Sheets collected her 12th win of the season in the circle for the Gulls, allowing just two runs all afternoon. So they win today 7-2. to They're in, going to be in play for the regional championship tomorrow. If the Gulls win their game against Williams at noon, they're off to the Super Regionals. If they lose, they play again at 2.30. Yeah, we will see what happens there tomorrow. Good luck to the Gulls. Jimmy Adkins now has been a big reason for the Gulls' success in baseball including two trips to the national championship and one national title. Today, after collecting his second out in the sixth inning, he became the all-time leader in innings pitched for Salisbury University. Salisbury won their game today over Penn State Harrisburg 6-2. They will play a regional doubleheader tomorrow in Pennsylvania. Now, if you have dreams of being a pro athlete, who would be the best person to get advice from about making those dreams come true? Well, the first pro athlete you can find after the whistle is presented by Shore United Bank. One of the best heavyweight fighters in the world was in Salisbury this Mother's Day weekend to show lucky students the inside track to being a professional mixed martial artist. Chris Dawkins is UFC's 13th ranked fighter in the heavyweight division. So about a dozen students got to learn from a top of the line pro, taking home some tricks of the trade to professional combat. For him to take the time out right now when he's got a fight in less than a month uh, against a dangerous opponent in UFC pay-per-view, we're very, very grateful for him. You know, growing up, you see Michael Jordan, you see Kobe Bryant, you see those guys in there. They're these, these huge stars. You know, you don't think that like you could ever achieve like what they are achieving, but I'm just some guy who decided that fighting was awesome and I've been fighting you know professionally for close to 10 years, some of the best in the world and I think that if kids have a dream that they want to be able to do this, by all means they can do this as long as it's stick with hard work and they, they stick with it. You know? In this seminar he went over different jabs, takedowns, grappling, boxing and more techniques so each of the students could grow as fighters. For him to come down here in the middle of a fight camp and to be able to share his knowledge with uh, our school is an amazing experience. Uh, and we're very grateful that Chris took the time to do that because this is all stuff that we can implement in here going forward. Yeah. And uh, it will help us you know, build the foundation for our own MMA program uh, so that we can continue to move forward and progress as martial artists. 410 Academy of Martial Arts is the place to be where students of all ages can learn. On June 10, Dawkins will be on the UFC pay-per-view 289 card. While he's prepping for that big fight, he wanted to show the next generation of fighters here on the shore some things he's learned in his 10 years in the pros. If, it's, if I take away anything, it's really just that, you know, I'm kind of like, you know, these kids in like the quote unquote the small town of Salisbury. Like, I'm from Philadelphia, never really was supposed to be anything. It's, it's something that I wanted to do. And I'm here, you know, top 15 in the world, a heavyweight, uh, soon to be light heavyweight. So it's going to be, uh, it's really fun and it's really awesome. Now, when we come back, we take a look at your weekend forecast with Chief Meteorologist Ritz Wordsick. Plus, classic cars make their way to Ocean City with the return of an event. Hello, this is Toby Peer. I'm the head football coach at Cambridge South Dorchester High School. You're watching Delmarva Sports Insider.